Welcome to the several nice product video and today we're going to demonstrate you the management capabilities of cluster control. Cluster control management capabilities stretch from backups to configuration management or even having load balancers. So underneath backups that's where we can start. So we have a couple of backups that have been made here. We can immediately see which ones have completed, which ones have failed. We would even be able to watch in the log files what was wrong with the backup, why it didn't succeed in creating one. And we can make either a backup right now or schedule a backup with an occurrence of like on a daily, weekly, monthly basis. Um, after the backup has been created, we would be able to restore the backup onto one of the hosts in the cluster that it has been created, or we would be able to restore an external backup. And the external backup obviously is not part of the cluster and that would require a bit of extra settings. The management features we have um, are configuration management uh, and that stretches from the MyCNF to the MongoDB configuration or the CarbD configuration. We have load balancers, so we can add, for instance, HR proxy. We can uh, install MaxScale or install Proxy SQL. All of them are a part of cluster control. We can even add in Keep Alive D to uh, to HR proxy nodes to make them highly available. We're working on that, applying that to other. Uh, load balancers as well. We have process management. If you have, for instance, a, a special process that is running on your system, uh, for instance, a Galera Arbiter, we can monitor that, restart it if necessary. Schema user management, software package management, upgrades can be applied automatically, and creating custom advisors. Then we have log files. So the system log files, we fetch them from the host themselves, and here you can see them immediately, read them, what is in them. If Even if the host is down, it will be very handy to have those log files on a centralized place. So if you don't have centralized logging, this is the way you can achieve that. Apart from that, uh, we have a couple of other um, uh, management features like removing nodes uh, or deleting the whole cluster. That's all part of the management as well. Thank you for watching this video. I hope we have demonstrated everything clearly to you. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below or get in touch with us via chat on several nines.com.